Hey, little lady. You'd be a lot prettier if you smiled. And he told me I wouldn't be pretty unless I smiled. And thanks to the puberty app on my phone, we can see what lies ahead. Well, I'm afraid you have to get them again. The man we thought was your orthodontist was actually a rogue periodontist. <laughs> <laughs> rogue periodontist. Braces. Again. Why am I the only one in this family who needs braces? Oh, my luck. We got this in the mail today. Oh, what is it? Did I get drunk and buy useless stuff on eBay again? Hello, Simpsons. It's me. Artie Ziff. Artie Ziff? Isn't that the rich guy who could have been our dad? I am the only man your mother has ever been with, and she doesn't have a single regret. Well... You stay out of this, Marge! April 12th, very rich man's wedding, regrets only. Chicken or fish? Or vegan? Bye! You're not really thinking of going, are you? That jerk kept trying to break us up. Now, I am sensing conflicted feelings. If you come, I promise you a wonderful time. And now to celebrate his Tupac Shakur. Don't be tardy. My boy Artie is throwing a party. This wedding's gonna be fly. God bless you. Now everyone's favorite, rinse and spit. I can't close my mouth. The brackets are holding up your lips at the edges. They'll adjust. The main thing is, you're happy. I'm not happy. Have a little nitrous. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. My headaches are so bad. Feet. You're a one in a million. Literally, don't fall off the roof. Homer Simpson, the man who beat me to Planet Marge. You've done all right for a billionaire. Is this wedding on the level? Here's the scoop. It's legit. In other news, local newsman hopes to score with caterer. This just in, she knows I'm married. Coming up at 11, nothing. Now, shut your eyes. You've never seen a body this enticing. <gasps> exactly what I imagined. <clears throat> Food coma. He'll be fine. Lisa, did you get your eyebrows waxed? You look amazing! I don't have eyebrows. Well, check out these twin caterpillars. Huh? <laughs> huh? And so, after saving Wilbur, Charlotte crawled off to die, as all barn spiders do in the fall. <laughs> so, as long as I'm smiling, it doesn't matter what comes out of my mouth? Or your nose. I don't need these anymore. Lisa! And am I shallow enough to enjoy this? <gasps> I am! <laughs> I'm so happy I could sing! <laughs> hey, gorgeous. Hey, Bart. Lisa? Oh, yuck, I didn't know that was you. <laughs> it's the smile. It's totally changed how people see me. Well, I can't figure it out, Jim. I was all prepared for a big presentation, but it went over like a nun at a go-go bar. Well, there's one thing you didn't prepare, and that's your face. Mm. Mm. Ugh, don't you see why I hate this? Because you hate everything? Because it makes that jerky old guy right. I am more popular because I'm smiling. Told you. Not a single picture of Artie. Maybe he has matured. Well, I guess being here sort of ends a chapter in my life. So, let Kyam. Excuse me, we need someone to walk the bride down the aisle. Could you? First, tell me one thing. How long is the aisle? About 20 feet. Mm, all right, I'll do it. A double cake. Hmm. If he ever hurts my baby, I'll kill him. Oh, for crying out loud. Oh, my God. This is too weird. Artie, you are the greatest lover ever. When we make sex, it is so, so good. Mm. 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 
and this is a picture of us at our wedding. You're so happy. And here's us on our honeymoon. I have a drawing of you saying that in Michigan. This smile is so wrong. There's nothing to be happy about. The world is a mess, and so is this school. Wait a minute. I could use my new power to change these things. Use it for good. I can make it happen. Hurry! Polls are in and you're doing great. Like every election with one week to go, this is in the bag. Don't be so sure. I'm up against a tough opponent, W. Spuckler. Don't worry, you just keep smiling. Well, I do have an orthodontist appointment tomorrow for a tune-up. In the bag, Madam President. <laughs> okay, kid, your bottom braces are on. <gasps> what happened to my smile? No, 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 this is terrible. Ow, ow. Uh, Ralph lost his retainer in the trash. What can we, uh, do here? New ones are $500. Uh, so just what is this secret mission, Chief? Let's see, let's take this. Mm, stop that. Oh, come on, Marge. This mini bar is paid for. Do you know the street value of this Toblerone? Homer, stop it. But first, there's something naughty I want to do with this bed. Are you sure we should be here? This is technically his honeymoon. As a woman, I just want to tell your wife what's really going on here. Sure, why not? Say it to her face! Ah! This one lacks kindness. This one keeps trying to kill me. This one's head is a toaster. And the slots aren't even big enough for a bagel. Why would you marry a machine, Artie? Yes. You're not dumb. You're smart. And I think this crazy project actually had some brilliance in it. Imagine if you use that noodle for good. And then you'll love me? No! Well then, I finally give up. Or do I? Ah, damn it. Uh, let's quiet down, please. The sooner we can get this debate over, the sooner the teachers can get ice cream. Our first candidate is W. Spuckler. W. W. Lisa, I'm sorry. What do you have? What I have is an agenda for this school. An agenda that looks forward. I can deliver results, while my opponent can't even spell results. Lisa doesn't sound sick at all. <laughs> you said you'd done this before. It was my machismo talking. <laughs> Listen, I tried to fool you, and that was wrong. This is an abomination. What are you doing at a school debate? My illegitimate son goes here. Duh, yeah. Oh, boy. I didn't want to believe my popularity was based on my stupid smile. Oh, but it was. Told you you should smile more. A toast. I have finally perfected you. You all look just like Marge, and you will never leave. Now. Which of you lucky girls wants to party with Artie? Hmm? I just don't like you. Oh, that counts as a kiss. Don't catch free.